Laugh me a laugh, grin me a grin And then I know that we can win Dance me a dance, joke me a joke And blow the clouds away Now oh, come to me a tune, sing me a song And we can help push life along Just you and me, come on and see Together we'll be okay Thank you, Liz, and welcome to the show. I'd like to say good evening to you. What's the matter with you? <laughs> My buckle's gone, John. Oh, come on. <laughs> I'm excited. There's nothing to be excited about. Take it easy, right? They're all looking at me, Well, Tommy. of course they are. I'm nervous. Don't be nervous. That's look. the idea of them looking at me. Look at that woman, Tommy. Look at her, look. What's wrong with her? <laughs> Turning her on, Tommy. Hey, now stop that. Leave the lady alone. She's perspiring. She's sweating as well. Hey, heavens above, you can't. I'm excited. Tommy. Excited? <laughs> he keeps looking at me, eh? Look at him. He's allowed to look at me. I'm going to get you, Just after. Stop. I'm going to get you. Stop after. it, will you? Well, he keeps looking at me. Get it together. Let's calm things down, will you? The bottle's gone. No, I tell you what to do. Your bottle's gone. I tell you what to do, right? Introduce our unforgettable song. I can't do. Why? I forgot it. <laughs> you really forgot it? I've lost my memory, Tommy. You've lost your memory? Well, I'll tell you what I do. I'll help you out. How do you mean? Well, uh, what's your name? Don't be stupid, Tommy. I know my name. Yeah? I've had a letter this morning. Right. Let's have a look at the letter. I've called, um... I've called Occupier. You're not... <laughs> Come on, what's your real name? Your real name? Yeah. I've called, uh... Wait a minute. Um... Don't rush it. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> you get a man. What are you keep looking at him. What's your real name? What do you call? Um, what's your first name? I'm called uh, Robert. Right. So you're called Robert? Yeah. Robert what? Yeah, I'm called Robert what? <laughs> Robert what? 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 Oh, Robert what? Is it? Is it what? No, I'm not Jewish. No, I know you're not. I'm not suggesting a person here called Robert what or what? Call Robert what to what? No, you're not. What's my name then? Is it? Is it what? <laughs> hey, I feel perplexed. I'm for Micah. Never mind. What you're Look, let's simplify it. Let's make a game out of it. A game? Yes. How <laughs> do you? Oh, like the Crapton Factor. <laughs> Have you seen it? It's cramped and fucked. He died in the land. Look, Robert Watt is it your second name, is it? Are you having that? I'll say no. Right, you're on your way. <laughs> so if trouble you, I'll leave him out. <laughs> so if Robert Watt isn't your second name, then Robert Watt is your second name. <laughs> You said Robert Watt isn't your second name, is it? Right. I'm called Robert Wright. <laughs> so, Robert Watt isn't your second name. <laughs> Robert Watt is your second name. Correct. It's a trick question. Is it? <laughs> you know what you're called? You're called Robert Ball. Robert Ball? Of course you are. Robert Ball? Right. That'll do for me, Tommy. You happy with that? That'll do for me. Right. Robert Ball what? No! <laughs> Robert Ball, okay? Oh, forget it, man. I told you what the name is. Step this way, gentlemen. Why, Why not? Yeah, I'm sure once you've had a good look round this flat, you'll jump on the chance to rent it. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> it's just came off in my hand. <laughs> oh, now, that is strange. Is mm -hmm. it? Yeah, no, that has never happened before. No. Bit cool. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I do just happen to carry a spare in case of emergencies. Yeah. Uh, but wait a minute, if that doorknob comes off there, we're all going to be locked in here. 
Don't you worry, Tommy. The walls are that thin, we'll steam our way out. <laughs> right. Eh? It's damp, innit? Patchy. When the last time it let rain in? When it rained. <laughs> in fact, it all looks damp to me. Oh, well, none of the previous tenants have ever complained. Who were they? Jack Cousteau and Flipper. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's very amusing. Mm. I do like a mug, a man with a sense of humour. What does this door lead to? The cellar. Done up next! What do you mean? <laughs> get, get oh, I did warn you about opening that door. Eh? It's another thing, that cellar's not waterproof. Oh, yes, it is. Not one drop of water in that cellar can get out. <laughs> I'm going to fool my brother in law. He's good at dump places. I can hear the sea. <laughs> it is the sea. Don't worry about it. I'll get that phone plumbed in before you move in. Nice wardrobe. Oh, yeah. That is brown oak. Brown oak? It's rusty metal. Oh. Yes, well, no, it did belong to the previous tenant. And by the looks of things, he's left his pyjamas behind him. <laughs> by the way... What happened to the previous tenant? He had to leave. He had trouble with his feet. What were it? Bunions or barnacles? <laughs> <laughs> nice bit of carpet. Oh, it's lovely, Tommy. You must be joking. It's watercress. <laughs> now, if you're not really keen on renting the place, I might be persuaded to sell you the whole house and grounds for, well, say, 20,000 quid an acre. Don't you mean 20 quid a gallon? <laughs> cool, isn't it? It's freezing in here, yeah? What did the other tenant used to do for eat? He used to go and sit in the warmest place in the house. Where's that? In the fridge. <laughs> and you keep pets? As far as I'm concerned, you can keep anything. Yeah? What sort of pets would you recommend? Ducks, frogs, alligators? <laughs> <laughs> Look at this! <laughs> I'll tell you what, Tommy. If that hunter kill it, it might have died of pneumonia. That's right. Go and put it in the fridge, we'll have it later. OK. Is this a window? Oh, yeah, yeah. Boy. <laughs> <Right. laughs> this place is damper than I thought. By the way, do them pipes ever get frozen up? Ah, they did freeze once last winter. Just once? Yes, from December to March. That's better. <laughs> Check them out. OK, Tommy. Excuse me, please. Are you going to take this place or not? Take it? Your floorboards, it's growing watercress. Eh, not only that. Your phone squirts water. Your cellar's not waterproof. Eh? See this here? Look at this. And the door comes off the doorknob. Oh, no, that has never happened before. <laughs> and your ceiling lets water in. Your mouse trap catches fish. And there's a windscreen wiper on the inside of the window. I take it you're not going to take it? Take it, I'm not going to take it. Of course I am. It's perfect for man and Tommy's new old girl, girl. Fetch her in, Tommy. She's marvellous. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, thank you, ladies or gentlemen. Um, um, what about me, Aunt Tommy? Just stop using that gag. You use it all the time, eh? You know what I mean? You go out of your way, you, to embarrass me. What do you mean, embarrassed you? Well, you do. You've ruined everything, haven't you? Eh? You've ruined every song, every routine, every sketch we've ever done. You've ruined everything. I know, Tommy, but apart from everything, what else have I ruined? What else is the left for you to ruin? Eh? I think an apology's called for. OK, then. I accept your apology. <laughs> oh, it's not me. It's not you. Who are you, then? You little imposter. Don't you try and impersonate my tummy. I know him, he's funny teeth. Now get off. <laughs> See what I mean? Hey? 
<laughs> going out your way to make me look a fool, embarrassing me. I'm not going out my way, Tommy. You live local, don't you? You live next door to me. Oh, come on. Look, I'm serious now, Robert. I think you should apologise to the ladies and gentlemen. Now, say you're sorry. If you insist. <laughs> I'm sorry, your ladies and your gentlemen. <laughs> there you go, you see. It costs nothing to have good manners. I don't know, Tommy. I've never bought any. <laughs> there you go again trying to embarrass me. Now, say you're sorry. You're sorry. That's better. I know it would be. Good heavens, I'm going to look at <laughs> Rock on, Tommy. <laughs> What's the matter with you? I'm excited. Well, come on and sit down and tell me about it. It's about them two birds that's coming tonight, Tommy. It's a long time since me and you went on a double date together. Yeah, be a long time again and all if you don't behave yourself. <laughs> of course I'll behave... Hey, I behaved myself in the laundrette when we chatted them up, didn't I? <laughs> when I chatted them up, you were too shy. You went and hid yourself in the spin dryer. <laughs> <laughs> I weren't hiding myself at all. I was looking for my sock. <laughs> that's sentimental value to me, that. It was the third sock my mum knitted me when I entered the three-legged race at school. Uh, you and your excuses. Can't be the girls, it's too early. Go and see what it is. OK. No, Tommy, will you come with me? Oh, I won't tell you you're too shy to answer the door. I'm not shy, Tommy, I'm frightened. <laughs> Last time I answered the door on my own, I got mugged by an Avon lady. <laughs> oh, wait, it's fine, Tommy. Hey, look with me. Hello, dears. Ah. Are you all right for me to come in? You're not an Avon lady, are you? <laughs> Avalon lady? What are you talking about? I'm the lady that's up a side. I just thought I'd pop over and see how you was getting on. Well, that's very nice, Mrs... Uh... Well, actually, the name's Turnbull. But everybody calls me Irene. <laughs> well, come in, Irene. Thank you very much. <laughs> my name's Tom Cannon, and this... Pleased to meet. And this is my little pal, Bobby Ball. Ball? What do you want me to do? <laughs> <laughs> oh, soppy. I won't bite you. Unless you want me to. <laughs> Hey, take the notes of him, Irene. He's a bit peculiar. <laughs> he looks a bit peaky to me. You could do with some feeding up. <laughs> Give over, Irene. Well, look, Irene, now you're here. What can we do for you? <laughs> what can we do for you now that Nothing. you're here? Nothing. Nothing. No, I'll come over here to keep an eye on you. I know what it's like, young fellas living on their own. They don't always look after themselves properly. Hey, well, isn't that nice of her? Nice of her? Don't you recognise her, Tommy? Mm. It's that woman off the telly who's always sticking her nose in other people's business. <laughs> it's not. Don't be stupid. She looks nothing like Hilda Ogden. What's the matter with you? <laughs> She's just a nice, harmless old lady. It's a lovely flat you got here, in spite of the filth. <laughs> well, that's pretty nice of you to say that, darling, but uh, we are waiting to meet our girlfriends. Your budget looks like a wilted lettuce. <laughs> <laughs> that's all right. Don't worry about me. Mm. I'm not keeping you. But, uh, Irene, it's quarter to seven. I mean, should you be up this late? <laughs> quarter to seven? You bar me. It's much too early to go to bed. Unless you both fancy coming over. You are my nothing, <laughs> eh? She's sex mother, Tommy. She's going to end up pregnant. <laughs> We've made a mistake here. No. What about us all having a quick one? Wish you luck in your new flat. And then I'll push off. Rock on, Irene. I'll get you one so you can push you off. All right. right. Great. <laughs> all right, Irene. Yes, yeah. I'm all right. Oh, shoddish wine. It looks like whiskey to me. No, no. We keep the whiskey in the hospital bottle. Frighten the burglars off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, I won't bother, thank you. Got any sherry? No. Nearest thing we've got to that's a bunch of Spanish grapes. Hey, I used to have a job in a vineyard once, you know, but I got the sack. 
Treading the grapes. I got the sack. Keeping my socks on. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> He's a screamer, he? <laughs> I, I, I haven't laughed so much since the day war was declared. <laughs> Never mind about the grapes, darling. I know all that keen. The pips get under my top plate. Hey. I'll give you a bucket for your top plate. <laughs> <laughs> you know, the stars when you give me the pip. Only sometimes, Tommy. I must be improving. And don't you worry about me neither, dear. I mean, I don't need no entertaining. I'm quite happy sitting at my bar myself. Like this. I love a good seat. Tommy. <laughs> She's going to be here all night, then birds are coming in a minute. Well, let's try something different, then. Uh, something subtle. I'll give her a subtle in. Right. <laughs> Good night, Irene. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> you get it? I'll see. <laughs> Ain't it subtle enough? <laughs> That's a lovely old song, ain't it? Whatever made you start singing that, dear? Well, well, the reason... Well, it was always his mother's favourite, and she always used to sing it to him at bedtime. Oh, yes. I thought his name was Bobby, not Irene. Oh, well, well his mother would have preferred a girl. Thanks a lot, Tommy. That's a relief. You know, just at first, I thought you were singing that to get rid of me. Irene, we wouldn't do that. Need a stick of dynamite. I know where I'm going to stick it. I'll go and get some. <laughs> Can't use dynamite, you'll wake the budgie. You think of everything for me, Tommy. You two keep talking among yourselves. I'm beginning to feel rejected. Oh, don't feel rejected. It's my little pal here, Bobby. Keeps having these dizzy spells, Irene. Oh, dizzy spells. Oh, I keep having them. Oh, aren't they awful? I've been having mine since I was a kid. My mum used to tie a string to me nappy and use me as a yo-yo. <laughs> Matter of fact... I can feel one coming on now. It's quite all right. Don't panic. It'll soon pass, as long as I can sit quiet for an hour. I know. You need to You don't want to sit still with a dizzy spell. Let me walk you back to your place. I mean, there must be something on television you're dying to see. No, dear, I don't watch much television these days. You do? No, I don't. You do? No, I do not. I'm sure you do. I do not watch much television these days. See? The programmes, it's all the same. Sex and violence, sex and violence. I can get my fill of that down at the Derby and Joan Club. <laughs> She's going to be here all night, Tommy. I'm dead sick. You say you feel sick? Yes, I did, Irene. Well, I'm not surprised. I don't think you're eating properly. I'll pop in the kitchen, shall I? Make a nice hot meal? No, wait a minute. No, Irene. You don't understand, do you? We're going out for a meal with all the right. girls. And they're going to be here any minute, any minute, any minute. <laughs> no, no. I heard you the first time in triplicate. <laughs> it's all right by me. I don't care who comes. I'm all right. Carry on. Do as you please. Come on, Hey, Now what are we going to do? I know what I'm going to do, Tommy. I'm going to get her. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> lad. <laughs> Short a bit of leg, huh? <laughs> Hey, you can't as an old age pensioner. I'll kill her, Tommy, with her half purple spots. You can't do that. You can't do that. Look, <laughs> you've got to make allowances, right? We'll be old ourselves someday. I'm going to get all of her, Tommy. No, you well, can't. Not until everything else has failed. I say. You two aren't getting fed up of me by any chance. I mean, you would say if you was, wouldn't you? Okay. I mean, there's no sense just being polite. Well, how could we possibly say that? I could very easily. <laughs> what did you say, Bobby? What did you say just now? I just said I feel a bit queasy, that's all. Then sit down on your BTM and <laughs> shut up. And you too, Tommy. Now, you two. I'm very hurt and disappointed. You've been trying to get shot of me, haven't you? Ever since I'll come. Us? Yes. Trying to get rid of you? Yes. Irene? Yes, we are. Shut up. There's nothing to worry about, though. We're just waiting for our girlfriends. Crackling bits of crumpets. <laughs> Are you alluding to June and Hazel in those tunes? So you know them? 
I say I do, they're my nieces. What's more, they told me all about you, so I thought I'd come over and suss out what kind of fellas it was. Was taking advantage of them. No, we're not taking advantage. This is our first date. Yes, I believe you. Thousands wouldn't. <laughs> anyway, you're quite nice fellas, so they'll be all right with you. They're right little bundles of mischief, ain't they? <laughs> They're right little ravers. <laughs> <laughs> they take after their auntie Irene when I was a girl. <laughs> That'll be them now. OK. Hello, girls. Hey, hello, girls. Come in, girlies. Dummy shy. Hi, Hi fellas. Hello, Auntie Irene. Irene. Yeah. We'll, we'll be going now, Irene. Here, just a minute. Hang on. I'm coming with. You coming with us? <laughs> what for? Show girls. Ooh. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's amateur night at our local strip club, and I have booked a table for three. Hey. And are they the amateurs? Got it in one. For rock, rock on, on Irene. Irene. I'm a good man to dust off my tassels. Give you something to swing from. Thank you. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. I've just thank said you. thank you. Thank you? Thank you! Once again, I thank you! Thank you! Thank you and thank you! Thank you! Where are you going? Thank you! Where are you going? Get off, where you can. Thank you! Come here. No, come here. Come here. I don't want a drink. Sure do. Now shut up. Thank you! Come here. Thank you! Come here. Tommy. I said come here. I'll get annoyed. Come here, I won't tell again. Now, come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm not a flipping dog, you know. Well, I know. I never said you were a dog. You said... Come on, come here, come here, come here, come here. Like we're a flipping dog or something. Hey, don't you mince more so me. <laughs> you said I were a dog. I never said you were a dog. In so many words. Exactly. You instituted it. No, but I mean, did I say you were a dog? You said... Well, did I? You well, said... Well, did I? Did I? Did I? You well, said did I? Did I? Did I? Did I? Listen. Well, did I? Did I? Did I? Don't be ignorant. Well, did I? Did I? Did I? Tommy. Did I? 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 No, I didn't. Well, sit. I'm fed up of you now, always arguing. Go on. Get off. I'm going to sing this song on my own. I'll sing it with you, if you want. No, you won't. Forget it. I'll do it on my own. Eat it. Laugh me a laugh. Grin me a grin. And then I know that we can win Dance me a dance, joke me a joke And blow the clouds away Rock on, Play me a tune, <laughs> sing me a song And we can help push life along Just you and me, come on and see Together we'll be okay Open the door, open your heart And then we go A Scotchman and a canoe. I don't know. What's the difference between a Scotchman and a canoe? A canoe tits. <laughs> yes, yes, sure. Doing it again, I'm... Yes, right. Yeah. Good night. I can't say it.
enjoyed the series, Bobby. Think the lovers back. <laughs> Another series. <laughs> I get it. Okay. <laughs>